Hey guys, Derpy here! And for the foreseeable future until Cat gets more merch! But we have some great merch today, guys! We have some brand new posters of Karina and my series! I might be a little biased, but I do like my poster! You guys don't even need to get them as posters! We have notebook versions so that you guys may write down your dirty little secrets into it! We will judge you. Anyway, enjoy the video, guys! The content within this video is not suitable for children. Viewer discretion is advised. Uh... Which stairs goes down? There. So it does. My apologies, my lady. I'm not good. I'm not good with them. Sorry, my, my yeah, my lady. I, I'm, not, I'm not good. Good with the stuff. You're working on it. That's are not all that my matters. strong suit. It's okay. Okay. Um, I've never been to this area that um apparently Iswad has. Oh, this is like near the ritual where you got pulled in from the blood spot. It is. Oh yeah. Oh. Not great memories, but thanks for bringing yeah. it up. Anyways, we got down here. I call this, this this is one of my best friends right here. This tree, it's a nice tree. Yeah, it's a nice looking tree. What, the name, the name is Bark. Cool. Anyways, the Lord's up here. A personal study. But doesn't he have another personal study? No. Yeah, the. You know, the, oh, I guess it's not really a personal study then. The one in the tower? Oh, no. that, that That's just his other study. He was like, for some other story. But th 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 this is more like, I don't know. I'm okay. going to be very honest, my lady. I don't know my things. Yeah, I know. Um, yep. You can hang out with Bark then while I... Uh... I always like hanging out with Bark. He's, he's a good friend of mine. You see, the other vampires would do. Sometimes they would come down here. And they would, they would, they would tie me to Bach. And I'll just wait. That's sad. I'm sorry. Can go friends. Okay. Well, I'm just gonna get up there then. Okay. Gotcha. Gotcha. I'm gonna go climb Bach. Okay. Great. Okay. Oh God. This this is hard. Okay. Uh, with a dress. Okay. Eh. All right. That's a dumb way to get up there. Okay. Oh my God. Oh. <laughs> God. I uh, did not expect you up here. What can I? Well, what can I offer you? Uh. What's going on up here? This is a little. Uh... Ah. Yes. Well, this my personal study. You've been here, of course. I I've never been here actually. <laughs> Well, of course you have. Okay, if we're talking about like my previous life or whatever, uh, we've already established I don't remember that. So. I didn't mean in your previous life, Cat. Did I actually? I sent you to my personal study to collect the information you needed for the church. This is the study you met? Yes, Demetri should have led you to it. No, um, he led me to your room and... Uh... We looked there. Well, to be fair, I kind of forgot which area you wanted me to go to because uh, Dimitri started talking about like a, you know, a bug sandwich. Uh, and the books there. Yeah, is that any, is it like a concern or? Did you happen to find anything of? Uh. Well, I mean, I found something that I think could be a good plan, if you would like to hear it. <laughs> yes. Please. Go on. Well, first off, I'm really sorry. I really did not know. I mean, Dimitri was literally talking about bug sandwiches, so, like, um, you know, it was kind of oh, hard. Oh, yes. His uh, signature dish, as he likes to call it. Yeah. Um, the thing is... Uh, I did look uh, through, I mean, I picked up, like, a few scrolls, and, um, one of them was about your, um, payment you're doing for Saqid for bringing me here, um, 
Right. When I gave you access to my personal study, I thought you would have chosen one of these many books of mine. Some of them are outdated. But are these all your journals? Not all of my journals. Huh. Okay. Some of these books are of rare variety, unable to be found. Some one of a kind. Well, I know the plan was for us to give information to the church. Yes. And information, I thought, would be, like, journals or, you know, personal diaries or something that I would just be like, hey, there, he has a plan to go to, like, I don't know, the other lord's castle in, like, two months. And then you would have known about it and be prepared if they were to try and attack you. Um, but... Correct. Because I saw the artifact list, which, you know, um, I may have also read up on all the other artifacts that you do have. Um... There's the one that you were going to give to Sekid, which I thought, maybe this would be a better opportunity. The vase? Mm-hmm. The vase? Yes. Explain. Well, it's going to be delivered to Sekid. They don't know where he is, or where the other, you know, vampire place, religion they thing don't. is. Uh, they don't. I highly doubt they ever will. Well, if you're going to have it sent to them, it could be beneficial to maybe lay it as a trap. Maybe we can frame it as, I found this information, and they're going to be delivering this. And since this is something the church might be really interested in having, I thought it was more prevalent for them to have than, let's say... And then we can go on and around it. Yeah. Hmm. Then they'd basically... I mean, they probably would know it was probably a trap, but... That doesn't mean it still wouldn't be effective. Very cunning. Very cunning indeed. <laughs> Thanks. <sighs> you didn't see anything else, did you? Uh, no. To be honest, I got lucky. Some of those scrolls lucky. hold very personal information about myself. Oh, um, yeah, no, I, I, I didn't... No, I, I literally just got really lucky and the first group of scrolls I picked up were about your artifacts and stuff. Good. I thought you were taking one of the tomes here. Heavens knows the church hates magic. Would have appreciated it better than one of the books. Well, the thing is, Svad, they want to kill you. Any information pertaining about you or how to get closer to you and killing you. I'd have to weaken myself with one of the books. Yeah. That's what I thought was more prevalent. And if I told them, hey, I wasn't able to find anything on my, you know, broad search, but I did find out about this through gossip, that might be, you know, the good way to win. Right, right. You've shown good initiative, Kat. Thank you. I congratulate you. Thanks. <laughs> so you've never been in here before, right? Have you? No. I don't think so. <laughs> I imagine you may have some questions. Uh, I feel like knowing about it would make it worse, so... Well, they are worthy sacrifices for my magic. Okay. You know, this place, or those churchgoers, I must know, why didn't you take them, take their word? To go back home. I mean... Well... I think you know this place hasn't been really good for me. It is seldom a kind place to foreigners. Uh, especially from a different world. <laughs> yes, yes, something like that. But... I mean, yeah, I've almost died repeatedly. My life's been in danger repeatedly. 
I've seen a lot of awful things, and, you know, I, I do miss being home a lot, but at the same time, I think I just miss the conveniences of everything. Like... The conveniences? Like air conditioning, heating, central heating, um... Phones? Technology? I do not know what any of these things are. Well, just take my word for it that it's kind of, like, convenient for me. Like, you could talk to someone all the way around the world from the little device in your hand. <laughs> they have a butterfly for that. Yeah, I know, but... Well... To be honest, I don't have a family back home. I never knew my parents. I was put in the system when I was young. This system? Orphanage, I guess. I guess that's the term you would probably use here. Ah. Uh. I bounced around from home to home, and... I wasn't really a good kid. And then I thought I finally made something of myself. I got into college, and... I didn't make many friends, and the friends I did make, I was kind of like, Oh, if we want to go to this restaurant, but we need like a reservation for 12, let's invite Cat. It was never, let's go and hang out with Cat, because we liked hanging out with her. It was more like numbers thing. You know what I mean? You have no other lovers? No. I think I was too weird and... I don't know, shy for it. I guess I was just a fucking loser back home. I literally had nothing holding me back. I had no one that cared for me. I I kept sabotaging every chance I got by just doing something stupid, by procrastinating, by just being lazy and... I knew I was being lazy, I knew I was being stupid, I knew I was sabotaging myself, but I just couldn't help it because I just didn't have anything going for me, and... Shh. Cat. Here, you will be a queen. Or at least, the closer you can be here. <laughs> yeah. Granted, you won't have some luxuries in life. Especially that afforded of a royalty. Then again, that might change. But ever since I've gotten here, I've never had anybody care about me this much or want to talk to me and not think I'm weird. Maybe you do think I'm weird, but at least you're polite about it. I just, yes, I could go home, but that would mean hurting you, and I think you're a good person. Granted, you think I'm a good person? Well, I mean, some of the stuff you've done is a little weird or fucked up, like the whole village stuff, but again, I, I don't know the customs of this world, and maybe it's just weird to me because I'm a human from a different place, but you've been good to me, and... That means a lot. And I don't want to see you get hurt. Kestrin was a lot like that. Looking out for others. Thank you. For your... Consideration. Thank you for everything. <laughs> Please. Don't say that. Well, you listen to me talk endlessly about sappy shit, so... I should at least thank you for that. Yeah. Yes. There is only one thing we need to teach you if you're going to be here. Yeah? It is the cursing. 
That, yeah, the, the cursing? Yes, uh, it is unladylike or even un, uh, lordship like to curse. Oh. Noble men and noble women uh, can articulate themselves in a more fine, their way, finer way. Oh, yeah, that. Um, I, to be honest, I don't curse in front of the nobles. Uh, it's just around you and Dimitri. Uh, but keep it to that then. Yeah. Uh, to be honest, I only curse around Dimitri because he annoys. Well, not really annoys. He frustrates me. To uh. Yeah. <laughs> But I know he means well. But I can watch the cursing around you if it makes you uncomfortable. I do not mind, my lady. It does bring up the question a couple of things. Yeah? Nothing. I'm getting it. I'm not concerned for you, my lady. About what? I don't. Nothing. Thank you for coming here to talk, talk to me. Tell me about these things. Yeah, of course. And, um, well, now you know that the my, my plan is what I'll be telling Isaac. What, what I'll be telling the church. You know, um... Yes, you... yes, yes, church, church members. Would you like a... Steal the scroll. Give it to them as proof. I'll make the appropriate adjustments to these... Uh, to the caravan. They'll be transporting the artifact. What if they figure out that I kind of betrayed them? Do I just say that... Maybe they heard that you heard word of church activity in the area, or is that like a I cop out response? I will send a letter. I will send a letter to Sakid, but I'll keep it on my men in case one of them are to fall. About it. Okay, good. Have it personally intercepted. Great. Well, um, I'll leave you to your magic. And personal journals. Magic studies. Yes, your magic studies. I will leave you to it. Do you wish to know how to do it as well? Probably one day, um, but right now, I kind of want some macarons. Supposed to run you to the wolves would be a bit too quickly. <laughs> but go on. Have your, have your two treats. I'm certain you've more than earned it. Thank you. I'll talk to you later, Lord Isfod. I will see you soon, my lady. Uh, don't mind this. I'm gonna look a little weird crawling down this because I've never. You need the help. No, no, I got this. Don't worry. Okay. Dimitri should have helped you up. The yeah, I know ladder. he should have, but he uh, was playing with bark, the tree. So. Ah. Yeah. Yes. I remember that one at least. <laughs> Good seeing you. God. Okay. And. Dimitri! Oh! My lady! Hey, we're I done. was not in the tree. I. Yeah, you weren't. You weren't. You were on the ground. How was it a little talk with Lord. The, the, the Lord. Lord is fought. It went very good. How about we go get some macarons oh. from the kitchen? Okay, I follow your lead. I have no idea what macaroni is. It's not. Well, you. There's there's mac there should be macaroni noodles here. Do you guys have macaroni and cheese? We have cheese. Do you have noodles? I think. I'm gonna introduce something amazing to you guys. What? What is it? Just watch. <laughs>